Hi kids, today we will learn about water pollution. So let's get started. Kids, we all need water to live. We can't stay for even a day without drinking water. We all love to drink water, and we need water for so many of our routine tasks. All the water that we use in our home for various purposes comes from different water bodies. It can be a dam, lake, river, or even underground water. So water in water bodies must be clean, as we all need to use that. But very sad, but true, that this water is getting polluted. We learned a lot about air pollution. Now let's learn what is water pollution. Water pollution is a contamination of water bodies like lakes, rivers, streams, oceans, even the underground water. And this pollution makes the water in water bodies unsafe for use, as it may contain toxic or poisonous substances that can cause various diseases to those who consume it and also leads to death of various aquatic organisms in it. Let's see some examples. Leakage of oil from big ships in a sea leads to death of numerous fishes and other aquatic animals. So water pollution results in poor quality of water, which is unfit for humans, animals, and plants. Now let's learn types of water pollution. If pollution comes from a single location, such as a discharge pipe attached to a factory, it is known as point source pollution. Other examples of point source pollution include an oil spill from a tanker, discharge from a factory, a sewer pipe, run off from a single farm. So these are point source pollution occurring from a single location. BP oil spill in 2010 is an example of point source pollution. When not one, but several sources of pollution are there that are contributing in polluting a water body, it's called non-point sources of pollution. For example, one body may be contaminated by multiple sources like agricultural runoff, city street runoff, construction sites and residential runoffs. Example, the Mississippi River is at great risk for non-point source pollution because it is so large and it is exposed to a variety of pollution sources. We learned types of water pollution now. Let's learn types of water sources. Water sources can be divided into surface waters and groundwaters. All the water bodies like ocean, seas, lakes, rivers, streams, and ponds are surface waters, that is, they exist on the surface of Earth. Surface waters are more prone to water pollution, as most of the waste discharge is left into the surface waters. A huge amount of water also exists below the surface of the Earth, as underground water, in the underground rock structures known as aquifers which we cannot see and seldom think about. Water stored underground in aquifers is known as groundwater. Groundwater is less prone to water pollution, but it is also getting polluted. So kids, today we learn what is water pollution? What are the types of water sources? and also types of water pollution. Now you may go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye.
Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects.